New developments this midday. Charges have been filed against a man who police say hit and killed another man while he was changing his tire. This happened along the South Loop. 60-year-old John Richard Vasquez now facing a murder charge. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez joining us now live. Kathy, we understand that Vasquez has been in trouble with the law before. Investigators say that Vasquez has been charged with three previous DWI convictions, and he was actually on payroll right now at the time of that crash with DWI. This is a previous mugshot of six-year-old John Vasquez. In addition to those DWI convictions, Vasquez has a long criminal history dating back to 1976. Others include unlawfully carrying a weapon, unauthorized use of a vehicle, driving with a suspended license, and assault of a family member. Police say the 55-year-old victim was changing a tire of his Ford Taurus on the side of the South Loop near 288 last night. They say Vasquez driving a Ford F-150 swerved out of his lane and hit the Taurus. Paramedics rushed both men to Bentop Hospital where the victim died. We reached out to the district attorney's office and they sent us a statement calling repeat offenders taking time bombs with only a matter of time before they kill someone. Right now they're requesting Vasquez to be held without bond since he was already on parole for DWI and again he does have three previous DWI convictions according to prosecutors so of course we'll keep you updated on this developing story. Reporting live in Houston Southside, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.